So on this Mossberg 500, I've been taking all the rust off of the barrel and I've cleaned the heck out of it and you can see these really deep pitted spots here. The only way to get that stuff out completely, all the rust out, is just to bead blast it and then uh, re-blue it. So you can see once it's clean with solvent, you can still see some brown in there. Not much, but uh, there definitely is still rust inside the metal. So what I'm going to have to do is just go over it some more. You can see the little faint scratches and that's caused by the steel wool. Usually I have triple zero. Right now I have some more coarse stuff. But I'm going to show you here how to get rid of a big patch of rust. Now I can feel that. This other stuff right here is just impitted, and uh, you can barely feel that stuff. But right here, I already hit it once, but I just barely went over it, and I realized maybe somebody would want to see some how to remove some of this really thick rust. And so, um, yeah, that's what I'm gonna do right now. And the best way, the easiest way I found to do is just use WD-40. But uh, I've got some rim oil that'll work too. Any kind of oil will work. And all I'm going to do is just spray that area down, just like that. And then from there, and it's clean. You can see the, on my finger where I rubbed it. You can see there's no rust at all. No rust that's coming off my finger anyway. Anyway, you just take your steel wool, and you run over it. I'm not left-handed, but I'm using my left hand here. And hopefully you can see it, all the rust start to come off. If you go too deep on the steel wool, you will leave scratches in the barrel, but sometimes that's the trade-off for getting this deep pitted rust off of the barrel. Now, with this rust spot here, the only thing it's going to do is just continue to rust. So even though it might make the barrel look a little crappy, um, I'm going to take off as much as I can here. If I go all the way down, it'll take all the bluing off and it'll look like just like shit. So. But you can see all that rust that just came off with that little bit of scrubbing. And now when I wipe it down with a fresh rag, you can see that even though it doesn't look great, probably 50% of that rust is gone. So that's how I recommend doing it. And if you can, don't use really coarse steel wool. I am because I've got some pretty aggressive rust. And uh, hopefully... I think this right here on this side, I think you'd be able to see this, but most of the rust spots you will not be able to see because of the uh, the wood and the pump and everything. Uh, so on that right there, that's just one tip on how to remove rust. I think it's the most efficient way. And uh, a brass brush works really good too. And the thing about a brass brush is it leaves the brass behind. So as you do this uh, with the oil, you're gonna see it looks shiny. It looks almost like gold in there. And then you gotta buff that out. So, it's better and easier unless you have some really big pitted holes, unless you really have to get in those holes. Just use some steel wool and some WD-40 and most of that rust will come off. Uh, unfortunately, it's just a sacrifice of some of the bluing, but uh, it's better than having the rust on there.